I recently received a message asking why I didn't use the new discus method for calculating display size in my earlier video. Well, today I'll discuss discus with you and show you how to use this formula to choose the right size display for your application. Now, discus is short for display image size for 2D content in audiovisual systems. These formulas consist of a scientific method for determining the minimum display size based on the known human visual acuity standard. This is the same standard that's used when you go get your eyesight checked. What it does for you is provide a standard reference that will guarantee that anyone with corrected or uncorrected 2020 vision will be able to comfortably read and comprehend the image on a display device. Now, the basis of this standard is the derived solution in the formula where any two of the three values are known. So, if you know the distance from the display to the farthest viewer and the minutes of arc angle, you can derive that the height of the display should be no less than your answer. For simplicity, we break down the variable for minutes of arc or arc angle into two categories of viewing. Now, we know that close examination of analytical data such as spreadsheets, engineering drawings, medical imaging, and so forth require a viewing angle of about two arc minutes. We call this category analytical viewing. We also know that general viewing of images, video, presentation materials, and the like require a much wider viewing angle of about 17.5 arc minutes. We call this category basic viewing. So, let's take a look at an example. Now, here we have a simple huddle space. We know that the distance from the display location to the farthest viewer is about 9 feet or 108 inches. We'll use a 1920 by 1080 display. We also know this is an analytical viewing application, so we'll use 2 minutes of arc angle. Now, here's the formula. To save you the math, the acuity factor for analytical viewing is 3438. So, if we multiply 108 inches by 1080 vertical pixels and then divide that by 3438, we get 33.9 inches for the required display height. Now, a 16.9 display with a 34 inch height gives us about a 70 inch diagonal display. Now, let's look at a training classroom example. In this case, we'll plan to use the use case for basic viewing. This gives us a 17.5 minute arc angle and the acuity factor for basic viewing is 200. Here's the formula. We'll spec a 1080p display. The farthest viewer is about 26.5 feet back or 318 inches. For basic viewing, we need to know the desired height of a text element. Let's say that the end user wants a line of text to be about an inch and a half high. We have a usable height in the front of the room to support a display over 4 feet high. So, using this formula, we can divide 1.5 inches by 48 inches and get a 3% line height. Now, if you're not sure, just use 3% because it's pretty typical. Next, we'll divide 318 inch viewing distance by the product of 200 times 0 0.03 or 3% to get 53 inches of image height. A 53 inch 16.9 display is 108 inch diagonal. Well, this is all you'll need to understand how to choose a display size using visual acuity standards and discus.